RogerEbert.com has said um, Morrison's world is one of the most breathtaking and haltingly disturbing cinematic realms of our, of our time. As opposed to this film, which starts out with the entire take, and then you see successive uh, versions that are faster until it becomes quite an abstraction. Uh, with release, the next film, we isolated a moment in a scene and then expanded both the start point and the end point in successive so that it becomes more of a reveal. And I should also say that in both cases, I was really inspired by the shot itself and thought that it needed to be featured as a, a longer exploration. And then the music came afterwards. So Otterboro was actually finished as a silent film, a 35 millimeter film. And then I asked my friend Todd Reynolds to compose music for it. Likewise, with release, um, it has its own soundtrack. It's from a outtake of the Fox Movie Tone newsreel collection. And um, uh, I was working on an installation um, in that building that's depicted um, with my friend VJ Iyer and VJ, a great jazz composer. Uh, created the piano soundtrack. So we'll look at release next. Um.